All right, so here we are at the wastewater dumping area. Um, we can notice on this particular floor plan right here that we've got two separate size pipes. We have an inch and a half pipe and we have a three inch pipe. The inch and a half pipe is going to be our gray water. Um, that's gonna be from our showers and our sinks, things like that. Um, so giving us a smaller pipe and to empty the coach, we would go ahead and pull this tab right here. Now, no need to hang on to your gray water while you were camping until the last night. Um, I'll tell you about that in a second. So you might as well just leave this open and let that gray water run right through. Now the larger one, the three inch, that's gonna be solely our toilet water. So that is gonna be our black tank. We wanna leave that closed and in conjunction with a chemical that we put in there, that's gonna break down our solids and our toilet paper to allow it to evacuate a lot easier, um, especially when we use those vents on the roof. Um, what we would do is hook up here, leave our gray open. This would go into the campground. We leave this one closed. Keep an eye on your monitor panel and it'll tell you when your black is full and when you need to dump it or dump it on the last day. The reason I recommend closing the gray um, my last night that I am there is I wanna hold on to a little bit of it so after I'm done dumping the black, I can go ahead and rinse out my hose with the gray water. Now this particular camper here is also equipped with a tank flush. We can use this tank flush and that's gonna be for the black water tank solely. That's gonna help our sensor sensors stay clean so they read appropriately and it's also gonna keep some of the odors down from the inside of that tank by flushing that tank out. So it's a real good idea to flush your tank. How you do so is hook the garden hose up here and it's gonna go into a vacuum breaker and then back into the tank. And it's gonna dump in there. Now don't make my mistake. <laughs> make sure that when you do have the black water flush hooked up that you have the black water valve open. It will fill up that tank with this closed and if you're not paying attention, it could actually end up coming back through the toilet and ending up inside the coach. So when using the black water flush, keep the black water valve open to allow that water that's being cleaned out inside to come out of the camper.